What's going on all you gamers? Here we are in Destiny 2 and today we're going to be looking at different ways and how you can get Glimmer and try to get it quite easily and quite fast. If that sounds like something that interests you, then stay tuned. That's coming up next. Welcome back all you guys and girls. Now here I am standing next to Lieutenant Bob which is obviously a made up name but he's got his gun ready and he's telling everyone that if they've enjoyed this video and if it helps them they should probably subscribe to the channel. I think he's got a good point. But for now you want to know how to get that really needed glimmer. Now don't get me wrong glimmer is not that hard to get compared to some of the resources in Destiny it's actually one of the easier ones but it's also very easy to use up fast. Now if you have a little look in my inventory at the moment I have 250,000 glimmer which is great except that's what it's capped at. So as soon as you have 250,000 you will not go above that. Whatever you pick up will just disappear. You're not going to get extra, you can't chuck it anywhere. It's capped at 250,000. And in Destiny Beyond Light there's actually probably more ways to spend it than any other. For example, if we go to one of the new features just over here. If you have a look, when you're buying some of the exotic items, it costs 150,000 glimmer just to get that weapon there. Obviously, you're going to need a lot of vital resources with it, but that just kind of shows you that glimmer, even though you can obtain it quite easily, you will be chunking through it. So look, these ones are 100. 125 and that's just one thing to get so you will definitely be needing glimmer during this season and for future seasons as well so what i'm going to do is i'm quickly going to spend a little bit and then show you how to obtain some right so after spanking quite a lot of glimmer on getting banties as such i'm now down to 214,000. now there are quite a few different ways to get glimmer but i'm going to show you what i find the best so one easy way to actually get some quick money and this one that you may not have thought of dismantling your shaders if you've got an absolute abundance of shaders that you don't want so say for example this green one just here or this blue one when i dismantle that that gives me 25 glimmer which might not seem like much at all but when you think about it, that's 25 per one you're dismantling. He says as he gets rid of a purple one and gets a legendary shard. Um, yeah, so stick to your blues and greens, which I completely forgot about. But yeah, so say for example this one, every single time I dismantle that, I'm going to be getting some easy glimmer. And especially if you have an absolute abundance of shaders that you've never looked at. It's just an easy way to kind of get a little bit of extra cash or glimmer as such. Now that's one easy way to get a bit of glimmer, but it's kind of a one and done deal. Once you've gone through all of them, you kind of won't be doing it for a while again. So there are better ways out there. And another way, which is kind of a nice added little feature, is to put stuff on your ghost. So now if you go to your ghost, and you hold Y. If you go just down to here, you have mods for your ghost now. And what you'll want to do is come right across to this third one and you can set it up how you want. Now, basically, this gives you economic mods and you can kind of chop and change. But if you were going for Glimmer all the time and that was the one that you were struggling with, try to get as high as possible. As far as I'm aware, I think the maxed at one is 65% extra glimmer, which is really, really nice. So I've got a four slot one there and that's 35%. So I'm guessing probably the six slot one will be 65. But yeah, that's a really nice one. And obviously it's just going to be on your ghost and you'll be getting the additional glimmer just as you play the game. So throughout kills, throughout strikes, throughout pretty much everything you do, you'll be getting the additional glimmer and you won't even know it. Now obviously a lot of playing Destiny will involve just actually running through the game, shooting at your enemy and basically going through battles as such. 
Now, this thing right here is literally made for that purpose. So, Rainmaker. It's a consumable and, pretty much as it says, a glimmer extractor found in the scraps of a lucky dismantle. So, pretty much from that you can gather what, how you get it as such, which is literally, you dismantle your items and if you're lucky you'll get them. And what it does, it gives you precision kills, have a chance to create a shower of glimmer. The effect lasts for 4 hours. Now that's really really good. So basically as you're dismantling gear and stuff you've got a chance to get rainmakers and if you are using those then when you're playing the game you'll be getting more money. Imagine using this along with the ghost perk that will make it so that you get a lot of glimmer really fast in the game. I would say probably trying at the moment the new place people are using for farming um, it's kind of a loot cave as such, but I don't know if they're going to hotfix it later on, but for the moment, probably try there. And that, this next way is probably one of my favourites actually. So what we're going to do is we're going to quickly jump into orbit, and from here what you want to do is go to your director, and then go all the way over to here to the Tangled Shore. Click on that, and then go to Thieves Landing. Right, so here we are and we've just spawned in at Thieves Landing, so jump on your trusty sparrow and you're going to want a jet bike just over here. If you're not sure what you're looking for, I'll just go to the map to show you what you want to do is click on the destination for spider. But literally if you just follow where I went, which is literally just to the left, you'll get here really easy. It's very close to your starting spot so you probably won't miss it. You're going to want to head down these tunnels and hop off your sparrow. Now this is the spider and if you speak to him, if you have a little look down the bottom here, he will sell you Glimmer. He's probably the only one I can actually think of offhand that does this, unless I'm missing any. But what you'll need is some simulation seed. I can't remember, I think it might change from time to time, but basically at the moment you just need that to actually purchase this. So you will need kind of a planetary substance or material, and then you'll be able to get 10,000 glimmer. So for example, if I bought this with 20, I would be getting 10,000 glimmer each time. So it's a really fast way to acquire glimmer if you have got the planetary materials. Now also, while you're on Tangled Shore, why not take advantage of what's outside? So if I just jump straight outside this area, so here we are, literally just outside his layer, and if you press select, obviously the map will show you all of the known locations as such. Now these things here, kind of like a cross with a dot in the middle as such, they're regional chests. Now these give you ghost fragments for this area and they also give you quite a nice bit of glimmer. So for example if I want to head to this one Now some of these can be a bit of a pain, I'm not going to lie, they're kind of hidden and such. So you've kind of got to learn where they are. So for example, this is what you're looking for. Collect those, and if you look, I've got 900 glimmer just from that one. And a couple of ghost fragments. But if you have a little look, there are 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, there's about 15, 16, maybe even 17 just on this one location here. So that equates to roughly 17k, give or take glimmer, probably a li little bit under. But yeah, it's definitely worth coming to the Forgotten Shore as you can buy the glimmer from the spider or just go around farming these chests really easy and if you're shooting at things as you go, you'll definitely net yourself some nice glimmer. 
All right, guys and girls, that's pretty much the way I tend to get Glimmer at the moment, and I've been getting it quite vast. So hopefully this has helped you a little bit, and if it has, then why not hit that like button, and if you'd like to become part of the Sofa Squad, then why not hit that subscribe and bell icon, and I'll be bringing you hints, tips, guides, and builds for all the new games that are coming out soon. Also, if you feel that you've got a better way for getting Glimmer, then feel free to drop it in the comments, as I would love to know. So, as always, take care. I'll see you on the next day.